Andy Cohen's Real Housewives gig isn't always peachy. In fact, the Bravo Big Shot was nearly knocked out by the Real Housewives of Atlanta alum Kim Zolchak Beerman's hulking husband, Croy Beerman. I just remember Croy yelling at me in the bathroom after the reunion, said Cohen in the new Housewives Tell All Not All Diamonds and Rosé, which was released Tuesday. In the cheeky tome, the 53-year-old Watch What Happens Live lead recalled almost getting clobbered by Croy, 36, while hosting the RHOA Season 10 reunion in 2018, which would be Kim's final appearance on the franchise. It was the only time during the whole run where I ever felt like I was going to get punched, Cohen continued. He noted that Beerman had also brought his gun to the reunion set, which was filmed in Georgia, an open carry state. But moments before his and Beerman's bathroom brawl, Kim joined her castmates on the reunion couch to defend herself and her oldest daughter, Brielle Beerman, 24, who shared a video of roaches crawling around series co-star Nene Leek's bathroom. During the season, Kim was also caught telling fellow series star Sheree Whitfield that there were a bunch of cockroaches in Nene's bathroom, while showing the 51-year-old the video evidence on her phone. She also penned a scathing post in which she deemed Nene sick and disgusting and claimed the 53-year-old lived in a roach but, when taken to task by Cohen and the other housewives, all of whom are African-American, for the demeaning and culturally insensitive shade during the reunion, Kim, the only white cast member, denied that her roach nest rant was racially charged. You're reaching. Reaching, said the mother of six, insisting her words were not meant to characterize Nene as an impoverished black woman living in the government-funded housing projects. Don't try it, Kim added. It has nothing to do with the projects or none of that st. A roach is a roach. Despite her rebuttals, Cohen and the other women continued holding her feet to the fire on the matter, along with other questionable comments she made throughout the season. And her hubby wasn't happy about it. Cohen told Housewives Tell All writer Dave Quinn that after the show, an incensed beerman confronted him in the privy, saying I didn't protect Kim enough or focus on enough positive things that had happened to her that season on the show. And Cohen candidly reminded the 6'3", 260-pound former NFL linebacker that his wife didn't give him enough good stuff to work into the conversation. I sheepishly said, well, there was really nothing positive to focus on, noted the reality TV head honcho, a comment he almost immediately regretted. I thought, this is it, dude. There are so many housewives and husbands who are tired of your shady ST and you're about to get your reckoning, Cohen remembered thinking in the moment, fully expecting Beerman to slug him.